<clears throat> That's better. Right. Let's go ahead and run Chorus 9. So this is the, the little loco. Chorus number nine. It is battery loco my, uh, like battery electric mine locomotive. There are only four controls on the loco: the reverser, power handle, handbrake, and headlight switch. The handbrake is a simple device which applies a brake band on the motor shafts. The more the handbrake is applied, the greater the brake force exerted. No, please note the handbrake on this locomotive is not very strong. The reverser selects the desired direction of travel. It can only be moved when the power handle is off, and it's not recommended to reverse the locomotive in motion as it can cause damage. However, in emergency, it is impermissible to reverse motors and apply power. The power handle is used to apply power. The first two notches are resistance starting notches and are used for starting only. They shouldn't be used for more than 20 seconds at any given time. The third notch is series running notch, whereby the motors are running at half power. And the final notch is parallel running notch, where the motors are running at full power. It is permissible to use either notch for extended periods of time. The final control is the headlight switch. It has three positions, forward, off and rear. There isn't much else to say about the loco, so let's get a little practice in. We need to take the gravity wagons up to Chorus for use later this afternoon. Head towards the reversal point and await further instructions. Release the brakes. or anything. Just me going, Oi, get out of the way! Yeah, there's no horn. Got to go down there with this thing. No. Right, proceed forward, couple of gravity wagons and carriage shed too. So, right, I'll take off on the first uh, put power on. Hey there, PS25. Uh, Robert, yes, this add-on's on Steam. It's the new Chorus pack from Skyhook Games. You need, obviously, the Chorus route to be able to use it properly. I just realised I've got the other screen on. What's going on? Bad 
better. Right. Is it seriously that violent to start off? Um, Ed. Right, could draw the wagons back up reversing point. Seriously? Suddenly we're so close these wild, these rails don't seem that, that small anymore. Uh, is it like the Type 3B? I guess similar because it's an electric, like they're both battery locos. We're propelling this lot up, aren't we? Yeah, this would run quite nicely with a mine knee, especially with the um, skip wagons and things like that. Yeah, I could do the gravity train after this. This is superb. What is this? A really unique little add-on. There is no horn, bus driver GP. No horn at all. Just me going, oi, get out of the way! Yeah, I thought the lamp should be aiming the right the other way, but it doesn't go the other way. Is that is that meant is that intentional, Ed? I seem to be able to turn the lamp off on but I can't turn it the other way shift out ah Okay. Hey there, DJ SP.
Tornado Ben, unfortunately, it has since been proven that the person claiming to be DTG underscore James had nothing to do with DTG whatsoever and was just trolling the stream. So, unfortunately, those codes weren't valid. platform coming up yeah pretty much my sentiment down there on the moon Getting there. Luke, what codes are you talking about? If you're talking about the the charity stream prize codes, they will come as soon as I get them from Dovetail, which will be hopefully not too much longer. Um, the TS18 codes that were give, that were um, won on Monday are all invalid. There were no TS18 codes. It was a, someone being an idiot on the stream. So th those win those wins unfortunately are invalidated. Coming into the platform now. Um, yeah, I haven't actually got the physical stuff yet, Cameron's Gaming. I'm going to um, try and round that up um, this week. Right, thank you, driver. Take the locomotive back down to Maspeth and park it in the carriage set. Oh what? I don't know a couple or anything, I just... What? Where did that fail? Why did that task fail? It's a cute loco. It's nowhere near as much fun to drive as the other one, but it's a cute loco. I'm interested to see what kind of scenarios people could come up with.
Uh, AP keys, I'll try and get them sorted this week. I mean, there are no keys for AP, but um, yeah, I'll try and get the AP stuff sorted and the um, uh, A2A simulations. train where the wheels are almost as big as the train. Imagine putting this up next to like a hall or a sort of castle or a tornado. I mean the train is probably the size of the wheels, isn't it? I still don't think that's a Clayton, even though it says so on the side. I think you have to do more than just put Clayton on the side for it to be a Clayton. <laughs> FEF3, yeah, really. <laughs> You've done them all, have you, Mark? What's your favourite one? Hide it in tornadoes, tender and slow space. Yeah, really. Put two of them in there. Probably literally put two of them in there. Our shunt coming up. Power line is your favourite, is it, Mark? Yeah, power line is my favourite as well. Where are you going to put the DC situ? In the hole at the front, obviously. Yes, Fab D. It says at the beginning it was a uh, a mining loco. Two locos and a few wagons, um, transportation euro. Mike, 45096, three months already, blimey heck. Loving the stream and all the Nebworth that comes uh, with it, Matt. Thank you very much indeed, Mike, much appreciated. Thank you for your support. And DJSB, notice the mug is back. Yes, we noticed the mug was back earlier on. And um, announces and things are all appearing on the stream, so all is right with the world. Cottage Shed 2. Ouch, Moggy. Ouch. Oh, oh. Ugh. Right. You can buy the Wickham trolley chipped, so I'm, I'm, I'm assuming there must be space for it somewhere. Probably use an N gauge chip, to be honest. DJSB, cheers for Moggy! Oi, we mean cheers for Moggy.
Thanks, DJSP. I haven't looked at it yet, I've seen the sheet, 589, but I've not actually looked at it yet. <clears throat> it's lovely little loco, isn't it, Darkness? Two really cracking little locos there. And being really scaled down locos, being small locos, you almost get more out of the route, I think. Yeah, I have no idea why that task failed. Um, I'm just going to remain grumpy about that. <clears throat> Invalid consis. Invalid consis? Did I have the wrong wagon set? I picked up the ones it told me to. <clears throat> all we need now is one, two, three, four, six, and eight. Yeah, <laughs> that's all we need. That's all right. Right. Okay. Let's do some gravity train. Hang on a minute while I find it. <clears throat> <clears throat> 